A huge victory tonight for a group of mobile home residents in Long Beach. They say they've been living in squalor and the landlords have refused to help. Today in court, they were awarded millions of dollars. KCAL 9 Stacy Butler is live at the mobile home park. It has reaction tonight. Stacy? Yeah, Jeff, tonight I sat down with a retired school teacher who told me when she bought her mobile home here, she never dreamed it would become a nightmare money pit. She could no longer afford to fix it, and no one wanted to buy it. That all changed today. Oh, dear God in heaven, Jesus, thank you. There's got to be justice here. Finally, an answer to her prayers. 68 year old Mildred Bejerano is one of dozens of residents in this Long Beach mobile home park who has just awarded $40 million after she and her neighbors sued the mobile home park owners, alleging they did little after neighbors complained of squalid conditions. I was ecstatic. I couldn't believe it because it was shocking to me that uh, that amount of money was awarded to us. Neighbors complained for years of raw sewage inside homes and leaking into the street. Rat infestations, the ground sinking so dramatically, the side of Bejerano's home buckled no matter how much she spent to level it. And this fire hydrant? See how high up it is because all the landfill has gone. See, it's sinking. Jeannie Edmondson lives across the street. Her case against the landlords hasn't gone to trial yet. A big slab of cement back here that's sinking. She says the landlords have refused to repair her sinking mobile home that's slipping into what used to be a landfill. She says she spent tens of thousands of dollars leveling her home, but now she can't close doors and cabinets. How long? Look at the roof. Here. The roof is cracking. Much. Attorney Brian Cabotet fought for the residents. He calls amazing people who deserve better. They're retired school teachers, vets, and those on fixed incomes. How can this happen? He still has a long battle ahead for over 100 remaining residents waiting for their day in court. But it just gets worse year after year after year. And these landlords that keep charging us more and more rent, it's ridiculous. Yeah, this is far from over. The landlords, of course, can always appeal. And there's still about 100 homeowners who live here. They're still waiting to be heard in court. It's the very latest from Long Beach.